Sam Smith up for six major awards. Many are wondering if this 22-year-old, how he's going to fare against some of the biggest names in music. T.J. Holmes has more. He's in the Social Square for us. T.J.? Hey, good morning there, Robin. Yes, uh, he had a huge year. Now he has six Grammy nominations. That's the same number as Beyonce. That's a big deal to tie her. But However, she has 17 Grammys at the house. Last count, he had zero. Now, that could change on the Sunday, but how many he gets depends on beating out not only Beyonce, but Taylor Swift. Good luck, young fella. Oh, won't you stay with me? It's the English newcomer. Cause you're all I need. Battling it out for his first taste of Grammy gold against the princesses of pop. I've been working, I'm up in here with some change to throw. 22 year old Sam Smith, unknown in this country just over a year ago, is up for a possible six Grammy Awards this weekend against some pretty stiff competition. I know I'm not the only one. Including a queen with 17 statues to her name. So how will the 22-year-old fare against the more seasoned competition? Well, first-timer Nora Jones took home five awards in 2002 for Come Away With Me, while Smith's fellow Brit Adele snagged two Grammys for her album 19 in 2008. But for every Mariah Carey and Alicia Keys, whose rookie success resulted in Grammy return year after year, there is a Christopher Cross. And taste of honey. For whom the Grammy gods didn't grant a golden welcome. Now listen to this, guys. He says if he beats Beyonce for album of the year, he is going to give her the Grammy. What? what? That's what he said. I call wow. bull, but that's what yeah. he said. Uh, <laughs> and I wonder what her response is. Yeah, yeah. No, it's yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Exactly. I got 17. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Something tells me if she wins, she's not going to do the same. No, yeah. she's not. <laughs> I don't know.